The Hezbollah Party of God movement was formed in 1982 in Lebanon by a segment of Shia community displeased with the secular, in their view, nature of the Imam moderate Shia party. There were also disagreements concerning whether Israel should be confronted using new organizational forms and methods of warfare. According to its general secretary, Hassan Nasrallah, since its formation, Hezbollah was a purely intra-Lebanese creation, relying on the support and aid from the Palestinian and Lebanese parties, while the support from Iran and Syria came later. Since the very beginning, Hezbollah's activities have been based on three principles. First, Islam is a clear ideological, doctrinal, and practical basis for the organization's functions. Secondly, its main aim is the struggle against Israeli occupation of Lebanon and Palestine and against Zionist domination. Third, it recognizes the Iranian Shia thesis concerning the necessity of vilayat e faqi the Shia doctrine which asserts that during the era of the 12th grave reappearance of Imam Muhammad al-Mahdi, the leadership over the Shia is transferred to high-ranking Shia clerics. Hezbollah, an organization, has a structure based on certain ideological principles that exist within the framework of a state that has no actual influence on the movement's activities. The party is led by Shura Council consisting of seven members, six spiritual leaders, ulamas, and one secular leader. The members are elected by the Central Council, al-Majlis al markazis consisting of the 200 most authoritative members of the movement. Shura Council elections consist of three phases. The first is a candidate selection, usually 70 to 80 people, which consists of both clerics and secular individuals who satisfy the criteria set by the top leaders. Those who pass this stage have the right to participate in the second stage. In other words, they become candidates for the Shura Council. As a rule, 10 to 15 people make it to the second round. The final phase consists of the direct election of the seven Shura Council members. Council decisions are final and religiously binding on all party members. They are adopted either unanimously or by the majority of votes. If there is a deadlock or a split within the Shura Council, issues are decided by the party leader, whose decisions are final and obligatory on all administrative institutions and cannot be challenged. This is how the principle of vilayat e faqi is observed and splits within the ruling elite are averted. The actual operations of the party are conducted by administrative executive apparatus known as shuratan fiz. It consists of five councils. 1. Executive Council, which provides oversight over political and organizational matters, including social, cultural, and educational activities. 2. Polite Bureau, which addresses intramovement matters. Third, Parliamentary Council, which concerns itself with Hezbollah activities in the Lebanese legislature. Fourth, the Judicial Council, which issues religious resolutions and carries out arbitration on matters of disagreement relying on Islamic law. And finally, fifth, the Jihad Council, which directs the movement including oversight, recruitment, training, equipment, and security. Each council is usually headed by a Shura Council member. The movement general secretary is Hassan Nasrallah, who is also the supreme commander of its armed formations. Leadership also includes his deputy, a spiritual leader who is also the supreme judge. Some Lebanese legislators, the military formation commander for southern Lebanon, and regional leaders of the organization. The executive council has various departments responsible for specific areas of activity – welfare, healthcare, information, press, finance, external communications, and coordination. <laughs>